What is up, internet? Damn it, my phone went off. This is kind of awkward. Sorry I'm so distracted, I put my phone away. Lots of stuff happening in my personal life, but something that I do want to talk to you guys about for my personal life, something has changed about me since the last time we last spoke, which was one week ago. First of all, this lovely little setup, this, as you can see it, this lamp that I made. Yeah, something has changed in me since the last time we spoke. It's something I want to share with you guys. I have an addiction. It's pretty serious. Um, have you ever heard of BBC America? Well, they're to blame, as well as Tumblr. I will not take responsibility for my addiction to Orphan Black. Yes. That, <laughs> I hope I scared you a little bit. I am obsessed with Orphan Black. Since the time you saw me last, which was last week to this week, I have binge marathon both seasons that are available online. Today I'm gonna give you 10 reasons why you should watch Orphan Black, and if this doesn't convince you, I don't know what will. But let me give you a breakdown of what the show is. Orphan Black is a show, it's in Canada, and it starts off with punk rock badass Sarah Manning seeing a woman that looks identical to her commits suicide by jumping off a train track. She steals her identity to actually just steal her money, but discovers that there is a whole nother life that she is actually involved in that she didn't know about. That being the Clone Club. That's all I'm gonna leave you with. Let's do this. Number one, Tatiana Maslany. Am I, I don't even know if I'm saying her name right. I just have to assume. She literally plays so many clones. She plays like half the characters on this show, I swear to God. She's amazing with different personalities and accents and mannerisms and, and um, hairstyles. <laughs> and it's, it's, you, when you're watching, you almost forget that they're the same actress playing them. She's phenomenal. Killing it. Number two, feminism. Guess what, guys? Not all things feminism are labeled feminism. Sometimes it's just there, and that is amazing. This show has a lot of feminist undertones and storylines that go along with it. Because here's the thing. This show is about women fighting to be themselves, fighting to have their lives be their lives and not be science projects, not objectified pieces of science. They are women just trying to live their lives. Watch the show. Number three, the storylines. Straight up, these storylines are amazing. They make you think, they get you hooked. It's science fiction at its finest. It's from the first episode, it leaves you wanting to watch more. You're gonna watch the ending of the first episode and you're gonna be like, what the fuck happens next? Watch it and find out. Number four, the special effects on this show literally give me life. I, I, I don't even know how they do it. It is insane. There is some scenes where all these clones are interacting and you're like, how the fuck? Because the main actress, Tatiana Maslany, plays all of them. How? Number five, have I mentioned Tatiana Maslany? Have I mentioned her? She's fucking hot as hell. Amazing, just amazing. Six, the fandom. This fandom is probably the nicest fandom I've seen on Tumblr. They are the clone club, which is what they are called in the show. Well, they don't like to use the C word clone so if you number seven science watch the show number eight Felix Felix is probably my favorite no he is he's my favorite character that isn't a clone I don't think I could pick a favorite clone because I love them all for so many different reasons Felix is my favorite character that isn't a clone he's hilarious he's sassy he's everything that you want number nine this show is still kind of new there are only two seasons out right now. They're, they're still working on the third season. That'll be out in the spring. So if you binge watch all 20 episodes, you could do it in a day. Maybe not both seasons, but you could watch the, I mean, I, last time you saw me, I never watched this show. I just wanted to. And then I watched it and now I'm different. So my last and final reason to watch the show, Tatiana. Maslani. I don't know how many times I can express this. This woman is fucking amazing. She plays all these awesome clones, all this amazing shit. When I watch a show, I like to binge watch it. I get obsessed with it really easily. I was recommended Breaking Bad and I fell in love with it. And I recommend it to my friends, Orange is the New Black, and they love that. So I'm recommending to you guys Orphan Black because recommending shows has never gone wrong for me. So I'm recommending Orphan Black. I would say I'm, I'm in the clone club. And I would say that I don't hate it. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe all over my channel. Like I said, next week, if I have 100 subscribers, which I don't know if it's gonna happen, I would really love it. I will, um, I will be doing something to my hair, possibly. And that reason I'm saying possibly is because 
this week on Wednesday, I am seeing One Direction at the Lincoln Financial Field in Philadelphia. If you're gonna be there, say hey. I doubt anyone will recognize me at all. I would probably shit my pants, but say hey. That video, I'll probably film a video for that and it'll probably be out next week. So the week after, expect a hair video. I'm considering cutting it all off, so. You definitely want to subscribe to my channel for that. And like I said, if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. I hope that you go watch Orphan Black, and I hope that you have a happy Monday. Peace out. I'm so distracted. I think a bird just hit my window.